uh, the party that represents Azimio in parliament is uh, Jubilee and ODM. Mm -hmm. Azimio is an entity in parliament. It's also important to recognize that there are three arms of government. And those three arms of government are yeah. checked by the citizens of this country. So you have the executive, you have uh, the judiciary, you have the legislature. In legislature, we have ODM and Jubilee MPs. They're mm -hmm. in government. That is government, you know, at the end of the day. And it means that they have a role in government. When you look at Article 1 of the Constitution, where the sovereign will is enshrined in the people, then the people must be directly involved in governance, public participation, the assets that we get in public participation and all mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. And I believe that um, what our Honorable DP is alluding to, uh, 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 you know, um, people who are in tune with the mindset that delivers the vision of Kenya Kwanzaa. Yeah. And, and, and then if, if you bring in somebody who thinks differently, uh, then that vision will not be met. And so he has ways of, of, of you know, he, he speaks in a very interesting way uh, that we call them, you know, idioms mm. and, and, and a certain way to deliver a specific message. Yeah. But his message is uh, the vision of the government must be delivered by the visionaries. And the visionaries really who birth the new government is Kenya Kwanzaa. Mm -hmm. But however, uh, the state... The, the arms of government themselves, they have everyone on board. And this nation also has to be, you know, uh, administrated and uh, checks and balances given by every other monarchy. We don't expect the county government or the national government mm. to do anything whatsoever without uh, the concept of public participation uh, being brought into, into, in, into, into administrating that civilization in itself. Mm. So if the people don't want it, the government cannot do it. Absolutely. But and uh, if the government does not create an opportunity to speak to the yeah. people the people who have given them the mandate and that mandate expires any time mm. or within five years then that thing shouldn't be done and the priority of kenyans right now is ensure that uh, we can afford uh, life mm. ensure that food is sufficient ensure that governance is proper ensure that all the destabilization that comes from insecurity and many of those things is dealt with okay there's a specific mandate mm. that the hustlers sent this government to do and that then becomes a priority of the day then dennis it means that uh, all those azimio allies who you know uh, decided to support the kenya kwanza government mm -hmm. which is democratic by the way mm -hmm went there with an expectation and now the expectation is now being controlled or managed in certain way i don't think so because uh, it's members of parliament mm. they are government you know we must uh, dissuade ourselves from the persuasion that uh, government is only the executive mm. Uh, members of parliament that is government it's an arm of government you understand yes those are odm mps who are going to discuss developments mm. Uh, and 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 we must uh, create a balance of depoliticizing developments at the end of the day mm. you understand yes. so if an odm mp wants to meet the executive and discuss about the projects that he has mm. within his constituency but that is government discussing the fact that the you government. see that now there's an outrage there then it means there was high expectation even from members of azimi of odm who joined uh, you know uh, been spotted in state house they've been spotted by with the deputy president and now when you talk of development then what kind of development were they expecting if it's now a point of you know, John, come uh, lately. <laughs> Victor, it's very important for us to understand yeah. um, uh, the constitution, our system of governance. Our system of governance is devolved. If anybody okay. from Azimio mm -hmm. wants development, they have an MCA, they have a governor. And within that area, it's their village people who are there. They can go and decide we don't want toilets, we want roads. You understand? Mm -hmm. This over-dependency with the executive is the disease that we fought against even in the last regime. Uh, developments are discussed at the local level. That's why we say politics are local. They, we have to move away from this obsession okay. of, uh, of, of thinking that uh, if you want a road in Homabe, mm -hmm. Homabe you have a governor. And, and then if that governor then has the opportunity to speak to the president and say, you know what, help me uh, deliver what, what needs to mm. be delivered here, then that should be delivered. 